how do you become a better salesman? One way is very easy and it's completely up to you. You can't blame it on the customer. You can't blame it on the company. You can't blame it on the boss. So what is it that will make you successful that's completely up to you? Product knowledge. That's it. It's that simple. Knowing your products. Knowing your product line. Knowing what they'll do. Knowing what problems they'll solve. Well, good afternoon, everyone. I'm Larry Hendrick with The Magnum Life at www.themagnumlife.com. And last week, I attended a webinar by David Allen. He is the inventor, the teacher, the guru on getting things done, which is a methodology toward getting organized and increasing productivity. All, all things that have to do with that. And he spent an hour and a half with about 1,300 of us online in this webinar. And I was fascinated by the fact at the end of the webinar that not one single time did he seem uncomfortable with what he was talking about. Did he seem to be uncomfortable with any of the questions did he seem to be uncomfortable with any of the information that he was relaying to us? Now, here's the difference it made. While he was totally comfortable and confident in the information he had to share with us with all that product knowledge, what it did was it turned it from kind of a selling situation <laughs> to a conversation. We were just having this casual conversation with David Allen about getting things done. When I work with young reps in the field, one of the things that I'm fascinated by is that they don't know their product lines. They don't know the products. They're not familiar with what they do. They just seem to think that they'll learn all of this information by osmosis. Unfortunately, those of you who are successful in sales know that that's not the case. In writing with them, when questions came up about the product line that I was representing, it was very easy for me to just step in and take over that part of the call, answer the questions, you know, satisfy the customer or prospect, and then close the sale. That was easy to do, wasn't difficult. But inevitably, in those calls, there would be questions come up about other products, not what I was selling. And I was always amazed at how uncomfortable these young sales reps got. And I say young, sometimes they weren't young. I was, I was surprised at how uncomfortable the sales reps became. Basic, simple information packaging, some little technical detail, pricing, delivery dates. It was always amazing to me that their stock response was, I'll find out that information and I'll call you or email you. What a waste of time. And I would suspect that I saw probably a half a million dollars in sales lost just last year alone from that very thing, sales reps not knowing the simplest thing. How does this come packaged and what's the price? Well, you know, I'll get that information back to you. Between the ones that fell through the cracks and the ones who went ahead and bought from somebody who knew how much their product sold for, the sales that were lost have got to be tremendous. Know your products, get comfortable with it. When you find a problem that a prospect or a customer has, how are you gonna know if you can solve it unless you know what your products will do? Study, crack open the books, do your homework. That's what you get paid to do. And then you can be successful. That's today's quick tip. 
and let's be careful out there.